Hi, in this video we're going to show you how to disable the protected view message when you open uh, certain documents. So you'll get the protected view message if you open a file like a Word document, Excel file, that kind of thing that you've downloaded from the internet or it could be something that you've uh, opened from an Excel attachment, that kind of thing. So what it does, it just kind of gives you a warning saying, you know, do you trust this document and do you want to open it? And then you could just say OK and be on your way. So I have this uh, document here, this calendar was downloaded from the internet, so it says protected view. Be careful, files from the internet can contain viruses unless you need to edit it. It's safer for say protected view. So if you want like a read-only, view-only mode, you could just look at it in protected view. But if you want to edit it, you'll have to click on enable editing. And then, of course, that gives you the chance of you know, any kind of macros or viruses in there, of letting them loose, I should say. But if you um, always trust your documents, you're always getting them from trusted sources, and you're sick of having to say OK to this, or you know, you click in there and you realize you can't edit because it's locked, you could just turn off this feature altogether. So to do this, so first of all, if I were to close this, reopen it, it would stay you know, with this message. But once you click Enable Edit, then the next time you open it, it will be gone. It's not going to keep popping up every time. So to change the setting, you can go to File, into your Options, then you want to find the Trust Center, and then Trust Center Settings, and then you want to find the Protected View section here. So there's three boxes here to enable it from files originating from the internet, which is what this one was, uh, unsafe locations, and if you hover over it, it'll kind of tell you, you know, temporary internet files, that kind of thing. If So if you open a file from there, it'll give you the same Protected View message, and then Outlook. So you could deselect whichever ones you want, or you could deselect them all if you, you know, feel safe. So let's say, um, I trust anything I downloaded from the internet, but these two I will leave uh, enabled. So I click OK, click OK, and I'm going to close this, and I'll open it again and see what happens. So now that message is gone, so now I could start editing right away. So once again, open up uh, Word, Excel, whatever, go to your options from the File menu, Trust Center, Trust Center Settings, protected view and then deselect whichever ones you want or all of them and click OK and then you won't be uh, bothered with that message anymore. And then FYI, there's also a section for trusted documents so sometimes you'll get a different kind of message asking if you trust the document and there's also trusted locations so if you want to play around in there and change the settings this is where you'll find them as well. Alright, thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe.